All right, today I'm gonna teach you how to cook with stitches. The first thing you gotta do is you gotta cook. You gotta choose the right skin. Now, this is the skin you wanna cook with. You pick any other skin, you're gonna lose the game. I guarantee it. So, what you wanna do is you wanna pick the right build. Obviously, you wanna win, don't you? You wanna cook with stitches a little bit, you gotta be the build. You gotta get the sausages around the neck glowing a little bit. All right, here we go. Ready? If you are the solo tank, Meaning, there are no other warriors on your team. You are going to go with chew your food. Or, if they have a mage, you want to go dampen magic. Why? Because read it. Every 8 seconds, gain 50 spell armor. Great. Beautiful. But, if you get this, what's going to happen is your devourer is going to be amazing. You're going to be cooking. You see this little thing on his stomach here? It's going to be slapping sausages all over the place. Guarantee it. Alright, here we go. Chew your food. Now, once again, if you are the solo tank, no other warriors, you're going to pick Amplified Healing. You're going to get 30% healing from Healing Globes. You're going to get 30% healing from your Devour. Everything I tell you about it. All right, here we go. Amplified Healing. Now, usually I go... Um, it depends. Save it a flavor is very good. If you're the chef, you get the improved bonus here. You see the forks in his back? It really helps you save it a flavor. So, uh... If you want to do that, you could do that. I mean, listen. Or you could go last bite. What it does is uh, you want to get the last hit on the minion with it. Beautiful. Because you just get that bonus with the 30%. Oh, boy. It's malicious. Very hard to hit. Very hard to kill. Especially if they're, like, focusing you. It's like, wow, look. You're at 10% health. And all of a sudden, your health is just bugging out. Because you're just, like, regenerating like crazy. All right. Here we go. This and this typical scenario here, we're going to go last bite. Now, I like to go gorge because it's just a fun ability. We just eat people and we cook them in the stomach, you know, just a little bit. All right, um, you know, this one's good. This, they turn this little green goblin into a madman. You got to watch this. Hold on. I'm going to show you in a second. Um, everybody going this now. Fuck that, man. I want to hook. I want to hook some motherfuckers, you know. Hungry, hungry stitches. We are a chef. You see this? With this skin, if you go any other build, if you don't take gorge with this skin, you are a fucking idiot because... I'm going to tell you this is the best fucking build for this skin. That's it, because you're cooking. You see those eggs? Those eggs are done, but he still has them in the pan. You know, you don't want to leave them there too long. Okay, hungry, hungry stitches. Here we go. We're going to try to get a little cookaroni going on here. Oh, oh, look at this. Oh, he's getting cooked. He's getting cooked. This is how easy this fucking hero is. Here we go. Oh, oh, are we going to hook him? Oh, but you want to you wanna stun him again. Look at the little green goblin. Look at the little green goblin fucking him up. Oh, boy. See, that's the build. You do that to the whole team, you kill fucking everybody. You understand what I'm saying? Because then when you get low health... All right, can I spawn like 20 ally here? Oh, no, no. You can only spawn one enemy hero. I would have fucking 1 verse 12 the entire team with this build. I'm telling you, man. These things are crazy. This little wretchling, he's a madman. Hold on. Let's turn on the minions. Where is it? So if you kill minions now... You're going to reduce the cooldown of it. So you're basically like just spamming the damn thing. Watch, watch, watch this. So, so hold on. Just picture yourself with some other heroes banging around here. Oh. So there we go. We got one out. But it's still not too long of a cooldown here. We got four seconds left. But bro, what is Brightwing doing? Brightwing's just dancing right now. He doesn't even know what to do. Look at this. Two, two, two wrestlings. Look at this. Brightwing's going to get, going to get hit. Oh, but he gets cooked right on the fucking egg. You see the eggs? They're turning colors. They're turning pink. Alright, well, this is the build I use when I want to cook with stitches, you know? This is the solo tank cook with stitches build. There's all different other builds, you know? You got the, the, the slam build is like one of the most popular ones, but people are making the mistake. They go in that build when they're not the solo tank. I'm sorry, they go in that build when they are the solo tank. You do not want to do the slam build when you're the solo tank. Because you will get fucked up real bad. And just for, just for good measure, you gotta get a good hook in here. Oh, I didn't hook him! I didn't hook him! But it's all right. It's okay. We're going to cook another day, too. Uh, we can cook every day if you want. Cooking with Stitches is available Monday through Friday. When you come in, you buy a little piece of stromboli. We look at this. We're going to cook them again. Hold on. Look at this. Basic. Basic plays here. I think uh, whatever target you use on the Wretchling, it focuses that guy. I mean, look at it. It's taking five or six hits from this thing. Holy spagoli oil. Look at him, he's down. He's down. Oh, 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 for the mirror. There we go. Look, see, you're just cooking these NPCs. Beautiful, beautiful. 